Hey everyone, welcome to this video. This is Marlon from Marlon Mac Media and in this video I'm going to show you how you can convert a mono recording that's from a microphone that only records to one channel into a stereo recording so that you can have the sound coming out of not just one but two speakers. Now in order to do this you'll need a free piece of software called Audacity which you can go ahead and grab from audacityteam.org and just get the version that's applicable to your operating system. It's available for Windows, Mac and Linux and I've got the Mac version already downloaded and installed on my machine. So I'm just going to go ahead and open that up and show you how it works. So as you can see we've got the software open here and we've got in the top section some controls that you can use to manipulate your audio. And you've got all the menus up top as well as some more bits of information down here as well. What we want to do is to get our file into this uh, section so we can edit it. So we need to go to file, import and audio and navigate to where the file is. In my case, it's on my desktop. So I'm just gonna grab the right file that I need, open it. It's asking me here, do I wanna make a copy of the file or do I want to just edit the direct, sorry, directly edit the original, which is what I'll, end, I'll just do in this case. Um, I've loaded up the file now and there's a track which is actually a stereo track. So we've got a waveform here up top which is representing the left channel and we've got another section down here which is the right channel and as you can see there's no waveform so this is totally blank. What we want to be able to do is to copy this top section over here to the bottom section so we have um, a waveform on both. Now uh, before I do that I want to play this back so you can actually hear that there's only sound coming out of the left side. One, two, three, testing, one, two, Right, so clearly you can hear that only the left channel is playing back sound. Now to split this up into two individual mono channels rather than a stereo channel, I just need to click on this drop down arrow and select the option here that says split stereo to mono. And now we've got two mono channels rather than a stereo channel. I wanna click on this bottom one here and delete that by clicking the X and I now need to copy this one here by clicking edit and copy or you can do command C or control C if you're on Windows and we want to now create a new track which is going to be a blank stereo track I'll just expand that out so you can see what's going on so I'll click on tracks add new and go across to where it says stereo track and now we've got a stereo track which is empty and we want to now go ahead and paste what we've just copied onto that track and as you can see we've got it copied across to both channels now we can go ahead and delete this one here because we don't need that anymore and I'm going to play back the sound now to demonstrate that we've now got sound coming out of both speakers one two three testing one two three so that's good uh, we've got sound from both speakers it's actually a dual mono setup rather than stereo but it nevertheless gives you the illusion of stereo so what we want to do now is export this file so we can use it in whatever project we're going to use it in so we're going to go to file export audio and we need to rename it. I'll just add ST for stereo and I'll just put version 2 because I've already done a test export before and I don't want to conflict with that file. Select where you want to put it. I've got my desktop selected already. You can leave this here as WAV. You can, or you can select another option. You've got MP3 and other formats there, but I'll just leave it as WAV because that's what the original format was. And I'll go ahead and click save. It's here asking you for metadata, so you can put in whatever information you want to put about the um, information there if there's some music, but I don't need all that, so I'll just click OK. And now it's created a file on my desktop over here. I'm going to go ahead and click that just to demonstrate that it is now in uh, both uh, stereo, well, both channels, left and right. One, two, three, testing, one, two. 
and that's all job done so if this video has been helpful to you please hit the sub thumbs up button to show your appreciation as well as if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any of the new videos that come out to do with audio and video production as well as digital design my name is marlon and thanks for watching take care